All right, everybody, welcome back to Busted Knuckles Fishing. Just wanted to do a quick video, a follow-up video. The last video I did was uh, when we put the Rodan trolling motor on the front of this Gamefish 27 boat. We are out on a lake and uh, it really wasn't uh, comparable conditions to what we're used to when we're out fishing. So today we're uh, November, late November, we're in 60 plus 60 degree weather. So I wanted to do a quick video. Um, we're here by an island, you know, 10 feet of water or less. So um, I wanted to show you how well this thing in anchor mode is holding us in the, in the anchor mode right now. It's a buoy right there. And uh, we've probably got, I don't know, based on the, the flag here, it's pretty good, pretty good clip, wind is. And, um, but I'm gonna take this and shut the trolling motor off. The engines are in neutral right now. So basically I'm gonna turn the trolling motor off, let us do its thing. And I'll show you how quickly we drift off of this buoy. That way, uh, it'll be a good uh, comparison how well this thing is holding this boat in anchor mode. So I'm gonna turn it off right now, hit the off button. Trolling motor's gonna do its thing. It's gonna go into stow position and we'll see how fast we drift away from this spot. So if we were tied off with an anchor trying to find our fish spots on the, on the Garmin, it's very difficult to stay in position when you have, you know, when you're at 80 foot of water, you have a lot of rope out you know, for the anchor. So right now we're drifting away pretty fast. I know it's probably hard to tell on the camera, but within a few minutes, we're gonna be 100 feet or more away from the spot. And sometimes when you're grouper fishing, you know, you gotta, you know, that's very important to stay on your spot. So in my opinion, this, this trolling motor is worth, uh, worth the expense, uh, way more so. I know I showed you the joystick on the last video and on how much uh, it disrupts the water. And this would be a good comparison right now because if you look at the screen, the, uh, the screen is fairly relatively clear. So I'm gonna put it in joystick mode and put it in uh, fish point. We'll see what it, see if it disturbs the water. Right now to hold us. But you can see how far away we've, we've spun them. Now it's in joystick mode. Control the motor's off. And it's trying to hold us in joystick mode, like I said. And eventually, this screen will start getting populated with, with bubbles from uh, from the engines, depending on the current. But you can see how much those engines are back there being worked to hold the same position compared to where we were with the trolling motor. It just uh, when you're back here fishing, it's uh, a lot of chaos. Whereas compared to that trolling motor, it's a lot, uh, a lot quieter, a lot smoother. Video now we're in Sorry about the wind noise. So, uh, everybody be safe and uh, hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much. I got a few more videos coming on the way, so stay, stay tuned. Thanks so much.